He's right at home in the dozer. He loves to run dozer. Take this spruce too. Carrie's afraid of heights and they decided to shovel off uh, the attached garage. And so Matt and Robert are jumping off the roof. There. Problem. My pickup is just bouncing as Jeff's driving by here to go up there and start slashing. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. I wish, I wish there was wiggle of vision on this so you could feel it wiggling. Here, I'll wiggle my camera there for drama. Well, that doesn't show up for beans. I thought that'd be a really cool picture. The moon setting over this creek. It is a beautiful view, but my phone's not showing it. Hey, hit the like button. Echo. Echo! That's pretty cool. Good morning, Kenworth. Are you going to be a good girl today for me? Thank you. Oh, Carrie, I ordered this sunrise, especially for you, on your birthday. Hey, I hope you had a, or have had, by the time you see this, had a great birthday. Like Kenworth and I are ahead in. This dozer here reminds me of Carrie. I just neglect her. <laughs> Only use her when I need her. Oh, I don't. That sounded bad. No, she uh, she's a good woman. Hit the like button. I gotta get out of these guys' way. <laughs> we got Gary and Rob up here tearing the woods apart. Good thing it's not cold out this morning. Backing into position to load me. Finally got my airline thought out. Or Kim, I'll say it for you. Unthawed. <laughs> you want to drive Kim nuts? Say that word. Unthawed. I once knew a guy that loaded that straight. Trying to see if those trucks back there are gonna finish before Jeff gets us loaded. They got a head start on him. Um, we had to finish putting this airline back together. I had a frozen airline. So, got that taken care of. And trying to hurry up and bail the load on here. I'd like to run with those guys then. We don't have any. Got a, other trucks are running together, which is great. If we can have groups running together, because we have 11 miles of Woods Road and only like 11 turnouts or places to meet, <laughs> it's way better if we can group up a little bit. A lot less confusion or chances of meeting where there's no place to meet. Come on, Jeff. Come on, Jeff. They're still loading back there. Uh, you probably can't see that, but there's they must be getting awfully close to being done back there And you're getting awfully close too. That'd be good if I could run with them Of course, I will never be able to keep up to those guys Oh Gary Gary put his loader down Rob still got his up put the finishing touches on his load. Oh Jeff you're getting close. You're getting close just trying to form the top of that load so the chains touch exactly how they're supposed to so the DOT is happy and I'm happy and everybody else is happy but he's just about got me I'm gonna have to throw some chains over this we're 
leaving. See, I do like this truck. I think it's a damn dangerous whole riding truck, but this one will be just good. We got a truck convoy here. Oh, Gary's going across the ice bridge right now. The swamp is still weeping here. Well, Gary made it across. Good thing his dog was in front of him, showing him how to go across it. <laughs> that must have, that dog has a lot of energy to run like he does. And there goes Rob across it. They're held up to two loads within a few seconds of each other. Hopefully the third time it'll do it too. See my CV mic dangling like that? It's not only to drive you nuts, it's to hypnotize you too. Is it working? When you wake up, you will comment and you will say, David, you are fantastic. Oh, this hill's getting shiny. Somebody's sliding brakes. They're sliding tires. I don't even see Gary. Boy, Gary, you're not. Boy, this hill's getting shiny. recording I grabbed a higher gear because it was starting to slip with the Jake brake on high them poor trees the beavers really got them bad <laughs> I'm joking that's uh stuff that's already been debarked and cut in half and it'll go through the mill later well Carrie there goes your birthday present there goes your birthday supper. Uh, <laughs> there goes your birthday cake. Hey, I hope you had a great birthday. You know, at this rate, I may just have to take away your birthday next year. But it it's 200. And it's going to. There's 200. There. Now your birthday's gone next year. Aw, oh, she still got a dozen roses out of me, though. I'm holding up loaded trucks. <laughs> of course I am. Louie, the big hill is getting slippery, so Todd spread some sand on it for us. Oh, that's working good. Thanks, Todd. Truck loading back there. Gary's always in my way. <laughs> no, he's not, but I had to say it anyway. Gary likes to be on YouTube. I cheat. Jeff, he, uh, he hooks the chain onto them center stakes with the, with the bucket so I don't have to crawl up there. Look at that, and there it is. It is really soft. Oh, you missed one, Smith. He sees that really soft over there along the line. I'm just amazed at how much better those duels make, or how much difference they make. It, <laughs> I can't talk today. No, I haven't been drinking. I probably should start though. I'm joking. That never cures anything. <sighs> yeah, you can see how soft that is. it's staying late a light a lot later isn't it so that's the south end of the road the far end actually on you can't see can you you can't even see the delimiter down there oh you can that pile on the right the top of that pile is where i buried the timco and they're working on the south end here well that looks like a nice sunset in the picture or in my video uh, but I cut this area today, and boy, that's soft. So that's, that's all I got left on the east. Nice. The west side of the road here. Um, 
I'm feeling up Simcoe at the moment. But yeah, a lot of red rot, a lot of rotten dead trees on this side. Dean is really picking through it, trying to get rid of all that garbage. But this side of the road over here is much better. Thank goodness. Look, look at the spruce there. It's just thick, green, and then, well, let's see. Can you see how that looks? Not so nice. I don't know if it's just too old or too wet. It's definitely wetter over here. Well, Dad was having trouble with his loader. And he went down and recruited Jeff, I guess, to help him. But I didn't know that. I came over to help. And I don't know. It was a fuel issue. We messed with the fuel lines and all that. Nothing seemed loose, but it seemed like it was sucking air because there was foam in the water separator. Seems like it's working good now, so must have done something, right? So one of the things that happens when you pile a lot of spruce on the side of the road, that's a lot of weight there. And if we look down, there's a crack in the earth. Yeah, it's cracking off the side of the road here. That pile is sinking. The San Andreas fault line. Good thing we're not in California. I think the whole state was going to fall off. Jeez, my phone is glitching bad. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. Skitter Kev here. Thanks for watching and have a great day. This is Nuts 319 and Stump Jumper at the 2019 OLC. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. Do it again.